This is the verse to smoke on my wall. This is for when you're just starting out and can't make power chords yet. There you go, third finger on the sixth string, third fret. The D is open, and the G is open. And you're picking those with your fingers right now. Now the other thing that's going on there is we're playing too. We want to get that sound is okay for us right now. That's reminding us to mute those strings with our fingers and we're just landing on those strings so that the sound is cut off or muted. We call that right hand finger mute. this. Now this is how that part goes to get the sound like you hear on the recording, but not everybody can make that chord right off the bat. So there's two ways to do that which I'll show you right now. One way is to just play the top strings like this. D string, third fret, A3, D3. That's one way. And you're doing this with these two fingers here. The other way is to play this with your first finger on the 6th string 1st fret, lift it, and then play the other notes. So you don't have to hold all the notes down at one time, and it would sound like this if you did it that way. Until you get it very smooth. And then eventually, you can hold it down and it'll sound like this. And the way that works, and this will be on the chart that I hand out for you also, you'll go one and two, three and four, 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 one and two, three and four. Make sure you count when you do that. It's four measures. The third measure has and back to the fourth measure for both those G's. Slowly, that would go like this. One and two, three and four. 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 And, three and, four. and there you go. step. When your hands get used to this, you can start playing the power chords. <laughs>